All right, so uh, it's about 2.18 in the afternoon. Uh, after this morning, um, you're given the, or the, the choice to either go to a um, nice uh, hot spring hotel, um, but it was a little bit pricey and didn't really see the worth in it. So the other option was to go back to Tokyo. Uh, four of the students opted out. One of us had to go back to Tokyo because he was swallowed up by Kyoto. I'm not going to name any names. <laughs> but <laughs> the uh, other three is Jeffrey over here, Nate, and myself. What we chose to do was go to the second largest city in Japan, which is uh, Osaka. Um, so we've, we arrived in Osaka, took a train a little bit out. Um, there's a uh, famous uh, piece of architecture, the uh, uh, Church of Light. Is that what it's called again, right? Yeah, yeah Church of Light. Tada okay. Ando. Tada Ando. There it is. So, we're waiting for the bus and catch that over there and pick up the segment once we uh, get around there. Alright, so we've reached the destination. Here is uh, Tada Ando's Church of Light. That is the uh, famous cross right there. And it looks like we uh, we're coming at about the right time. Should be able to see it in its glory uh, once we get inside. I heard that sometimes they don't really let people in, so we're gonna have to kind of sneak in, act like we're religious, or I don't, I don't know. We'll see. But um, yeah, I'm gonna take snap some photos and see where, see where it goes from here. All right, so we've been harassed out of this church. <laughs> we've been continuously sneaking right back on, getting some footage. This time, we're sneaking around the front bushes. Crawled the back path and got to the front where the light shines through and across. I don't know what's around that corner over there. I'm a little too scared to find out, to be honest. But, um, there's the, uh, the cross. There's nothing going on in there. If you can see inside, nobody's in there with the doors over there. Nice. I wish we could go inside, but I don't think they're letting anyone. Alright, I'm gonna try to snap a few photos, see where we go from here. Alright, so we're going around the front again. We're gonna try to go up the paveway, slip a quick, a quick peek into the interior. <laughs> Is going on, they don't care, they're cool. Inside's the church, huh? It's pretty cool. Oh, is he calling someone over? Huh? I know. Construction workers on a smoke break real quick. <laughs> we'll wait till they're done. Alright, so we're able to find a little creek window. Or a little window slit that allows us to see inside. This is the famous cross that shows into the church. It's pretty nice. Next step, front door. Let's take a look at that though. Try to block. All right, so next stop is uh, the Expo uh, of 70 Park. It's held here in Osaka. Um, there's a couple places we want to see in here. Um, a lot of this uh, expo had a lot to do with Japan, the tablet, the tablet movement, and since that's what we're uh, studying in the studio, uh, it'd be cool to uh, see some of the stuff at the park. So I'm gonna head on in. So. We are just kind of walking through the park. We only got like half hour left going through the gardens. Pretty cool stuff. It's really beautiful actually. Wish we had uh, known that this was here a little earlier, but it was a rush day, so. It's kind of cool, uh, there's a lot of changes in um, elevation.
Alright, so here's the main gate to the uh, expo. Um, I wish we would have been dropped off here at the bus, but it doesn't stop here, so it kind of killed it. But right now, we're just kind of trekking all the way through. We started at the north, and I think we're traveling to the south. So, but the really reason why I'm set, setting it up by walking over here is to see the monster's beast. Right here. Shoof. I don't even know how freaking big that thing is, but it is giant. It is gigantic. I wish we could get someone to go over there just in scale. And we made it here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we actually were able to make it. We've only got 15 minutes. We want to head over to that expo building too. Um, but this thing is just monstrous. I'm gonna be, I gotta snap some photos and we gotta move on. There's Nathan down there. It's crazy. So I'll do a little panoramic view. See the flowers. Thing is just huge. So we got up close. This thing is just gigantic. <laughs> Wish I could look <laughs> there's Nathan. That's where the arm is, and then that thing doesn't even extend. It's huge. And the camera can't really capture just how gigantic and enormous this thing is. Tower of the Sun it's called. But uh that's pretty awesome. We got a couple of photos of us next to it for scale. In the back over here, Nathan you gotta give me a brief on this. Uh I'm not sure if this is actually it. It's uh <laughs> looking for the actual uh tower. You don't think so, that's a frame? No, that, I don't know the frame fell down. All of it? You didn't keep the structural core these balls would attach onto. I think all this left is one of the balls and that no, it's not it. This might have been it, I don't know. You don't think that that's a... I don't think this, it's it. That's just a... I don't know what that is. Okay, never mind then. False info. Cool. Alright, we're going to keep on moving try to get to the Expo. Expo 70. The uh, remaining building. Looks like it's closed. <laughs> They're playing the music right now to kick us out, but we're refusing, trying to get as many pictures as we can. I'm out of breath because we're sprinting everywhere. <laughs> but, oh, you think the, you think it might be in there? Uh, I don't know. It looks like it might be. Pretty cool stuff. Keep taking some photos. So we've exited out of the, um, Expo Park and crossed over uh, where they have the sports stadium actually um, for the uh, the event. So looks like there's an open gate. Another lucky uh, instance shooting right for it so we can get in the middle of the stadium. I want to be on the 50 yard line. <laughs> Panoramic view. Suspense. What? What was this used for? Nice. They did the ceremonies for it. The expo? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what else this has been used for. But they got a really nice track. It's a short field, so it's not oh they got they got 
It seems like a really short soccer field, even though they got it painted. You guys want to run a lap on the expo track? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Sunset in the back. That was already a workout running through that park. Down so there. Cool. I'm going to take some there, actually. photos. All right, so it's been brought to our attention by Mr. Myers. It's one thing to come to the middle of the field of the Expo Stadium and take pictures, but it's another thing to do the lap. So I'm gonna give him the I'm gonna give him the camera, and it's gonna take about five minutes. So so stay with me. I might walk in a couple of spots. I'm I'm, I'm past my prime. <laughs> I'll go with you. <laughs> Jeffrey will run with me. <laughs> Don't forget to stretch. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 